okay? Oh shit. This is thing in my car. Comment the name of this movie. Good morning. Hey, how y'all doing? Welcome back to my channel. It's gonna be a story time. But it's also gonna be like a story time vlog type shiz. A lot of stuff to do today. But I also wanted to film that video. And these nails getting fixed. Cause what is this? Oh baby. Oh baby. Y'all don't even want to see my toes right now. Like it look like look like somebody played duck duck goose on my toes. Like for real. I have a lot of stuff to do today. I gotta get an oil change. I'm gonna get my hair done, fix my nails, my feet. I'm gonna get my car detailed. I low key cleaned everything out. It just needs to be like vacuumed because it's like a whole bunch of paraphernalia. If you can tell by the title, the time the SWAT team ran up on me and my job and tried to arrest me over my viral video of me. It's gonna be so much better when I got my nails done. Like, I don't even feel like a bad bitch right now. Like, I'm gonna go to the beauty supply store, get some lashes. Next time I get back on here, I just wanna do this little intro part because y'all aren't gonna be riding with me. And yeah, hoes, my car is fixed. It's fixed after, I don't know if y'all follow me on Instagram, y'all should. But, so my car, January 8th, yeah, because I got a date. So January 8th, my car went down. Literally just pulled out, parking lot, not parking lot, up driveway. And five minutes later, turned onto the highway. Right when I got on the highway, my car slowed down to it. And I'm like, I had half a tank of gas. So I'm like, it's not my gas. I don't know what it was. I had to get my car towed. I didn't get my car licked out, licked at for like a week and a half or so because they was the, the mechanics were just BSing. And they had to have somebody come to my house because it wouldn't turn, it stopped cranking up. I'm like, hold on, what's going on? I knew I needed to get a brake fluid. And, but y'all, tell me why the mechanic told me I'm at work. There's water in the tank of my car. Why are they playing with me? Why would you do that? If I do something to you, it's for a reason. It's for a, a reason. Like a definite reason, not no BS reasons. Like y'all girls be doing stuff for petty reason. Niggas too. A reason. I'm not gonna say for a reason, but you have to have done something on that level to me first or something equivalent. I don't think y'all know what y'all doing when it comes to stuff like this. So somebody put water in my tank and it was enough water for him to tell me that it wasn't a leak. It had to be put in there by somebody. This is the mechanic telling me this. Um, so anyways, pay for it. Back whipping hoes, what you thought she was doing? Who you thought she was stopping? Wow, like y'all really tried to stop some shit. Like, wow. It's okay though. The person who did it got it. Boop, boop, bop. Boop, 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 bop. And now they claim they didn't, but it doesn't matter because baby, my car is fixed. The ass got whooped. And I'm living. I get my hair and nails done. Back to my story time. How's you talking about? Whew. Anyways, yeah, I'm gonna get my hair done. I'm probably gonna get back on here before my when my hair is finished. I don't know. This is really just a story time video, but I just wanna do the intro. Cause I feel productive. Uh, ugly as hell. So yeah. Um today's gonna be a good day. Catch y'all later. So Call me Aunt Shirley. Y'all kids want some candy in my purse? Let me stop. Okay, so mm, I just got my hair done. Um, she, I asked her to curl it this time because usually I just get it straight. But mm, I like somebody grandma right now with these pin curls. Okay, it's back. I'm back. TT Shirley. Is that what I said my name was, Auntie Shirley? Now I'm T.T. Shirley with these eyelashes. Yes, ma'am. Anyways, T.T. is outside of the nail salon for my nails done. But I just want to do the first part of the story time. So first thing I'm going to say is I'm not going to incriminate myself. I'm going to tell y'all what I told the police and what was said. So your girl is back. Oh. What are you talking about? Hear my toes. Toes. Boom. Okay, I'm ugly as shit. Lashes on. Like only thing I gotta do is drop these pins. And I'm trying to see if I want to look like an auntie this entire video. I think I'm gonna drop these pins. 
grab some marijuana. What I'm gonna do real quick. Ew. Oh, brother. I hate when that happens. Hmm. Come lips. Keep ass lip glosses that you be wearing for a little bit too long and your lips a little, little, little no. Gonna make my own lip gloss brand. Stop. Stop it. Okay. Get back with y'all later. Okay. So pulled over. I went to Z Shrap. But yeah, so um I got out of there really late. The nail salon, like it's dark outside, as you can tell. Um, so I not get my oil changed today and I had to also get one of my things in my car fixed, but the dude told me to come tomorrow. My oil change is gonna be waiting until next Wednesday because baby, on Wednesday they got that lady special. Hmm. And I look like a real lady today. What are you talking about? That 70s, oh my god. Oh okay, so yeah, I'm gonna talk about when I first realized the video was going viral. So the video was made in like May or June. It was dropped in definitely by June. But not it didn't go viral like that until a couple months later in September October so um first couple days people were sending to me they're like is this you I'm like oh yeah that's me oh um, and it was like you hell da, 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 da. people call me stupid all this other stuff that I don't really care about and so I was at work like I posted on my story only posted on my story when I seen key got reposted I was just like, because then when I seen Kegel, I reposted. Then I seen it was Juice World liked it. Rest in peace, baby. Love you. But oh my God, Juice World see me. He seen me. And he liked the video. So I don't care what nobody say. But that's when I was just like, oh, maybe, maybe this is getting a lot of views. I mean, people was telling me, oh, it's getting so many, so many views on so-and-so, so-and-so. But I don't, I don't know. So I was like, oh snap, that's crazy. Celebrities like retweeting or whatever. I was just like, oh yeah, cause they got a, they got fan bases and that means it's, I knew that once they they retweeted, it was like exposure automatically. So I was like, oh shit, it's naive. Um, I posted on my story. I was just like full video on whoever page it is on the YouTube video. Cause it wasn't my video, it was somebody else's video. Hey, hold on. Oh, hold on. Okay, but I got somebody pissed. So, the day Key Glock reposted it, I had went. I was at work. Well, I went to work, and then I was like telling one of my coworkers, like, you know who Key Glock is? Do you know who Key Glock is? Tell me why this man retweeted this video of me. I'm just like, yeah. I mean, people was telling me it was going viral and stuff, but it's just like, what? Oh, she did her thing. Oh, hunty, what do y'all know about this? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. So boom. Later on in the day, somebody from my job asked this girl from my job. She's younger though, uh, like twenty. So she asked me, "Is this is this video you? Cause it looks like you and me and so and so thinks it like it look like you." So I'm just like, "Oh yeah, it's me." Like that's crazy. Everybody seeing this video, even the people in my, in my job. Like what the freak? So um, my bartender he hear about it and he was just like. You're gonna get arrested. Who finna get arrested? I told him, push come to goddamn shove. If I ever have to speak to the police, I'm saying it's fake. So wait, I didn't even put my um disclaimer. I am not incriminating myself. I'm going to say it's fake. It is fake. This is what I told the police. It is fake. It's fake. But baby, I'm not finna sit up here and say it was real so I can get arrested. So I'm over here at the table. Hi, welcome to Longhorns. Is there anything I can get y'all to drink tonight? Any appetizers? We got the wild west shrimp, the white cheddar mush. What y'all like? So I look up. I'm reacting. It. I look up. I see the police. And my heart go a little boom boom, cause that's when my heart go a little boom boom when I see the police, cause boom boom, them police don't play, they don't play. So <clears throat> I'm not gonna play with them either. <laughs> I seen them, 
I go uh, to the back. Then my manager like, the police is here to speak to you. And I'm like, okay, can I just turn my money in? You know what I'm saying? Cause like at the end, of, I'm a server at Longhorn. If you haven't got that by my interaction <laughs> with my customers. First of all, they call, they had to call some corporate or whoever to see if they if they could even allow the police to speak to me during my shift but i was about to get off so they said that they could or whatever the heck and that was that so i go around back it's the swat police officer the dude dressed like a complete police officer he got this big old thing on gun on him all of that all of that shiz handcuffs all of that shiz and there's two there's a white man and there's another man black little skinny man with a hat and so we go to this truck yeah so we go to this truck and i sit in the truck and he and first thing he do is read me my rights why are you reading me my rights am i gonna go to jail so my first thoughts was like my heart was beating or whatever i'm like it's okay i don't care um ain't nothing gonna happen you know just you know just let myself know that i'm straight like no nothing bad gonna happen so i'm just like all i gotta do is tell them oh oh okay period okay oh my god she did so good i don't know if it's just this light or what what the f oh my god y'all gonna be like oh she a bad bitch yes sir second video yes sir yes sir nigga yes sir okay let me stop oh shit like my hair, like, oh, oh, I'm gonna always get this little pin out thing. Aunt TT finna be around. Ooh. Whoa. Okay. Damn, sexy ass bitch. Where you come from? Let me get your number. Let me holler, shawty. I know you ain't got no nigga. Okay, what's up? Okay, now, for real though. These mother truckers, these mother truckers, um, Read my rights or whatever, and then he asked me, "Do I know what they there for, or do you have any idea why we here?" And I'm just like, "Um, probably about this video." Okay, first thing at first, I want to know, police officers. I know y'all watching this because y'all watching everything. How in the hell did y'all find me? How did y'all know where I worked? Like, I didn't like I I posted it on my story, like the screenshot of Keylock retweeting it or whatever, but like on any actual videos. I never commented, I never retweeted it, I never liked it, I never did nothing like that. I never was like, that's me. I never was just like, you know what I'm saying? I never was just like, when I was like, hey, this is me, at blah, 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 and everybody seen it. Like, no, I'm pretty sure not really that many people, unless like y'all follow, you know, subscribe to the people's channels. Y'all probably don't even know who I am, like half the people, not half, more than half. So, <clears throat> I didn't comment on it. I wasn't fun to because, like, I get the video is like, you know, yeah. I know the video was hot. So, I didn't want to be like, you know what I'm saying? I just straight out say it's me. Like, I'm saying I play it smooth. But I, I guess I wasn't playing smooth enough because these folks popped up to my job. So, we in a car and he was just like, yeah, this is you in the video, right? And I'm just like, yes, it is me. But did y'all see the entire video? They're like, no, um, this is the only thing that we've seen. Oh, can I redirect you all to the YouTube video that it's from on YouTube? It is a prank. And they're like looking at each other, looking back at me, looking at each other. I'm like, do you need me to pull it up? So he take out his phone. He pull up the video. First of all, 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 I want to know why nobody is talking about how in the beginning of the video, I'm pretty sure nobody, nobody seen the YouTube video, but for those who seen the YouTube video, I don't think I seen anybody talk about how I got 10 kills in Fortnite when they bet that I couldn't. Boy, that's an average. It's, I said, they watching the video or whatever. I skip, go to the right part, nigga. See, that's where it is. That's the clip that you're talking about, which is fake. And so they phrase pause it or whatever, and they're looking at it. And I'm just like, you can look at it and it's edited and everything is fake and they're just like 
trying to say is like it's not fake and like they try to catch me in a lie because <clears throat> he was like so first of all they asked me is it a real gun so after they seen the full video they was like is this a real gun and i was like no it's a bb gun and later on i'm gonna tell y'all just right now later on dj comes or whatever because he was trying to pick me up from work why dj say it's a real gun i thought that shit was over with he was just like, but he said that he told me it was a BB gun, but it's, it was a real gun. I was like, okay. Anyways, and then they said in one frame, like in one frame, it was like a regular gun. And then the second frame, it was extended, the, the extended clip was in it. And so they had said, um, oh, well, this has to be a real gun or this is not a BB gun because BB, BB guns don't have extendos. Yes, they do. Yes, they do. They do have extendos. What are y'all talking about? Oh my gosh, she did the hell out my hair. What? Oh, wait. Let me get it out of side. Hold on. This my real hair, y'all. You, know? you hoes. Yeah, so they were saying, oh, when you were shooting out the window, like they kept going back where I was shooting out the window and they said, Oh, the way that your hand dipped, I'm a put I'm a military and I uh work with guns and I know the body language and when a gun is shot. So when your hand dipped, um, it shows that there was real gunshots. And I was just like, it was fake. And I was like, I'm in a moving car. If a car is moving, I will be moving. My hand will be moving. I'm moving. Like, what are you talking about? You talking about some my hand dip? Yada, yada, yada. So, no. And so that's when, like, they spoke to me for, like, 10, 15 minutes in the car or whatever. And I'm just like, keep saying, like, it's fake. Like, you know, y'all not going to get me to snitch on myself, snitch on anybody else. They ask me, oh, what street was this on? Do you know where? No. Mm -mm. I don't know where we was at. I really don't. I don't know where we was at. I don't know the street. I don't know nothing. We was at an Airbnb. That's all I know. And we had drove around. And that's all I know. Uh -uh. That's not going to work. That's not going to happen. So, like I said, like I don't know nothing. All I know is that it was fake. And that um, they edited the gunshots. And they edited everything that made it look so real in there. So, is this the truth or not? This is the truth that was told to the cops. This is what the cops have to believe because that is what happened. Okay, now for real though, like, I'm not gonna say anything on here to incriminate myself. So if you thought that's what this was, it's not. But I am gonna tell y'all about how after that, so DJ came, they spoke to DJ, they were trying to get the unedited video from, um, from the person who's posted page but that video was made a long time ago the unedited version they usually delete all those clips when they edit in the video <clears throat> so now uh they let me alone they let me go or whatever tell me why all these all the police officers there was like four like but there was detectives too investigators and detectives um so they gonna all get some longhorns to go so y'all came over here, harassed me, and they're going to eat at my job, and they're not going to leave me no tip. What is wrong with y'all? Like, at the end, before they let me go, he was just like, yeah, I believe it was fake. And I'm just like, um, we're going to still look for that unedited video, but for now, da 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 y'all can go. Wait, oh yeah, but first, now we can go. We had to ride back to DJ house or whatever, so he can show them his other gun that he brought up like i don't know why he was bringing up all this stuff but shoot they checked his gun when we went to the house they checked his gun the gun was legal clearly and they just wrote that down and yeah so i'm thinking that's it skedaddle i'm just like okay so no wait later on that day we had decided to get some longhorns to eat i'll go back to my job why one of the waitresses that work there that don't work there no more gonna tell me um You've been the talk of the, the whatever. I'm just like, uh, yeah, I know. Like, okay, I know. I know, like, the police came. 
everybody's looking at me everybody making it awkward everybody like making it bigger than what it has to be like just mind y'all business and go serve some people or something go wipe a table like okay so i was just like ah, ha 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 but then she was like looking on with like a ugly face and like judgmental face like girl why are you doing all that you just see me pop pop pow why you don't think i would pop pop pow you she gonna tell me this one made, made me even more mad that's why i'm so mad to begin with with what she said to me she gonna say yeah the managers was talking about firing you about what why i'm like oh yeah huh yeah one of the managers is back there she wanted to see you since you're here okay i walk back there i sit down because the manager she's sitting at a table i sit down hey divine you're back oh like, yeah i just grabbed i'm just grabbing some food or whatever blank blank in the front just told me that you wanted to speak to me i didn't want to speak to you okay blank blank why are you doing that why did you do that like dead at like why would you like why would you sit there and say that they wanted to speak to me and that they was thinking about firing me and all this other stuff when that wasn't true how are you gonna fire me because the police came and asked me some questions you cannot get fired off of that and i was really gonna go off of go off if they was trying to do that because like what why that doesn't make any sense so i was just like you know what okay so i get up and i walk and then we get our food and we leave okay so when was it october the day after this happened i had went to get a new id so i know that i have okay so october 2nd for a second i pull up to my house just like i did just now um pull it out right <clears throat> right at the stop sign like not even out of the complex yet i i'm going cop pull behind me i'm still in the complex right behind me as soon as i pull out y'all it's not even a minute until me pulling out of my like pulling out from where i live i pull out i see one car one police car i'm driving because it comes like there's like a another turning thing where the police came from another car behind them but that car went straight and the other police car followed me out so i'm just like i'm just like okay i'm not doing nothing wrong like let me just go to my destination where i'm going because i haven't left they haven't turned their signals on they haven't turned their signs on or nothing like that so i'm leaving outside the place right as soon as i get out i make my first left outside like outside the complex lights flashing i'm just like oh my god but i'm not thinking nothing of it y'all this is where it gets like real messy these georgia ass police so tell me why they stopped me oh you failed to use your blinker i was like I definitely use my, use my blinker and then your blinker light is out okay so that's why my blinker wasn't working because my blinker light was out so i'm like okay all right I handed my ID or whatever. So, uh, in Georgia, I don't know if this is the same for everywhere, but in Georgia, get your license before you're uh, 18. It's a class D license. And so I never updated my license, but I was over the age of 18. So in the system, like I just, my my ID didn't say class uh, C. It didn't say the right one. Cause once you turn 18, you need to get a class C license and switch from a class D license. So I hadn't done that yet. And these folks, he was just like, oh, well, first, he didn't even tell me that. First thing, after I give him my ID, he gonna tell me, get out. He come back to the car. And he's like, I need you to step out the car. I'm like, for what? He's like, I just need you to step out the car. So I step out the car because when a police officer tell you to do something, you just gotta, you just gotta do it. Unless you're gonna hit that uh, Slim Jim. What's that shit called? I watched that movie, not Slim Jim. What's it called? Slim and let me something yeah that movie was pretty fine but i'm not gonna no so i just get out the car and um second police police car two police cars for my brake being out right so if, it, if it's my brake being out my turn signal why am i out the car 
why does they nobody answers my question and then the second police officer that had pulled up comes with this the video on his phone this is you right what and then the other officer's like yeah we know who you are okay i already spoke to somebody actually oh who'd you speak to what like so first first i'm just like a detective he came to my job a few weeks ago so why y'all bringing this up is it not about my brake light and then he was just like yeah we know who you are and we know your your car i'm like that's not even the car it happened in. they didn't even know anything bro they hadn't seen the this is clay code police i think they hadn't seen the whole video i guess they know nobody got back to them or whatever i don't know if they was just bothering me i feel like they was just bothering me because let me tell y'all this um i'm like i already spoke to somebody oh we know that it was this car are y'all dumb it was it was clearly not this car my car is yellow how is it my car sir i didn't say how is it my car i was just like it was definitely not this car and i was like and i was like why y'all asking me all these questions is this not about my brake light oh you're the one answering them i said okay i'm done saying anything am i allowed like they, he was getting so rude with me man i oh i was so pissed off i was so pissed off because he was being rude to me for no reason like sir what like Oh, do you know where this happened? Did this happen in Clinton? Why are y'all asking me this? Are y'all detectives? I'm pretty sure y'all was not supposed to do that. And then, after all that happened, right? I'm just like, okay. Then they try to say, somebody else has to come get my car because I don't have my right license. They literally was trying to make me get somebody to come get my car because I couldn't drive it back because I didn't have my Class C license. I had a class D license. My license is still valid. I still passed my driver's test and you're telling me I can't drive because it's a D on here instead of a C? That is so petty. That is so petty. And then, or two in the morning, 12, it was like night. It was nighttime and they bothering me. So I have to call, I'm calling somebody to come get it. I, I call DJ. He's talking about something. Like, he, basically, that he not finna come get it. Like, oh. And then so, I basically call my, call my brother because my mom was asleep because it was late. So, my mom was asleep. And I call my brothers. They taking hella long. And then I guess the police get a call or whatever. And so, they're just like, um, you can go. Just drive back to the house. It's right there. Like, drive back over there. Because all I had to do is hit a U-turn and be back over here. Like, y'all, I had not even gone anywhere. Like, I was dead ass still, like, basically in the complex. Like, I had just went out the little thing. So, I just turned around. But before that, before I zoom off or whatever, tell me why these motherfuckers give me three tickets. Three. And you want to know how this, I know this is so petty. Two of the tickets were the same thing. I knew... I, I, I'm like not a court person, but I knew these like two tickets were the same exact thing. One ticket for my brake light, not using my brake light. Second ticket for my brake light not working. And my third ticket for my ID. So I'm like, why did y'all give me, I didn't say that, but I'm looking, I'm like, why did y'all just give me two of the same tickets? Why did y'all just give me two of the same tickets? After that, they i haven't had no more run-ins they have nobody has harassed, harassed me where i as i know about like the video but i was just like bro y'all got me messed up dead ass so i'm just like i go to the dmv i get my new license i go to autodome i get my brake light fixed and i go to the court date and when i went to the court date in december and i'm talking to the lady like that tells you like if they're gonna dismiss it or not so she look at the brake light not working and the brake light not me not using it and she's like this is the same ticket precisely so why the fuck did they issue me two the fuck so i show her my id i show her my brake light all things dismissed dismissed bing 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 gavel like Y'all, they really thought they had somebody. Y'all had the wrong one, not me. No, it was fake, baby. It was a BB gun. It was fake. They edited everything on there. Y'all not gonna get me. Like, y'all expect me to go in there? Yeah. 
I was shooting at somebody. They had me fucked up. Drrr. No, baby, I'm just gonna tell you it's fake because you can't tell me that a video is fake or not. It's hard. The internet, with the internet these days, it's hard to tell. There are four. Your girl got off scot free. Scot free. But I'm gonna move around from this area because they looking out for me now. I, I see that. I see that. Like, they was not playing no games. They pulled up here. Well, they was literally waiting for me to leave my spot. They literally, I, I'm pretty sure they watched me come to my house because I stayed, I didn't even get out of my car. They watched me come to my house and they was waiting for me to leave. And as soon as I left, they was bothering me. And they gave me three tickets for nothing. Like, I mean, for something, but like, they brought up the video during the thing. Like, why would you do that? Yeah, I think that's the end of this story time. I try to be funny, but I wasn't even that funny. So I'm not high. I'm finna just smoke a little bit later. But yes, end of this video. Like, comment, like, comment, subscribe, y'all. Um, if y'all feel like what they did to me was effed up, comment below. I never told anybody about it because I didn't know if I was gonna be arrested or whatever was gonna happen with that. But I'm free. It's 2020 and your girl free. She got her hair done. She got her nails done. And yeah, that's the end of this video. Follow me on Instagram, Jasmine Divine underscore. And then um also subscribe to my channel, like it, you know what I'm saying? Comment. It's my second video. Please don't let this flop. Don't let it flop.